Hi, my name is Anders Grieve. I am a staff physician at the Department of Clinical Biochemistry at Copenhagen University Hospital in Copenhagen, Denmark. And I'm also the first author in a recent publication in the British Journal of Dermatology investigating whether elevated plasma triglycerides is a causal risk factor for psoriasis. And why did we do this study? Well, there's mounting evidence to suggest that elevated plasma triglycerides or the metabolism of triglycerides to free fatty acids are pro-inflammatory. And interestingly, retrospective studies have shown that patients with psoriasis, a skin di disorder that is driven by chronic inflammation, have elevated plasma tri triglycerides as compared to age and sex match controls. And we therefore wondered whether there could be a prospective association between elevated plasma triglycerides and later occurrence of psoriasis. And how did we do it? While well, we measured plasma triglycerides and genotyped for triglycerides altering genetic variants in 100,000 individuals from the Copenhagen General Population Study that were free from psoriasis at baseline. Next, we noted any occurrence of psoriasis during the next 10 years of follow-up. The genetic data were used for Mendelian randomization analysis to assess whether the association between elevated, elevated plasma triglycerides and later occurrence of psoriasis was causal. And what were the main findings? Well, the key novel discovery in this study is really that elevated plasma triglycerides are prospectively associated with psoriasis in both observational and causal genetic analysis. And why is this of interest to dermatologists and their patients? Well, this study really has the potential to impact on workup, treatment, and prevention of psoriasis. And more specifically, it builds support for future randomized trials to investigate whether lowering plasma triglycerides may affect psoriasis disease severity.